Hawaii vacation rentals, better, but not there yet. Hawaii vacation rentals reported overall increases in supply, demand, occupancy, an average daily rate compared to 2020, but lagged behind the pre-pandemic totals reported for the first half of 2019. In June 2021, the total monthly supply of statewide vacation rentals was 591,100 unit nights. June 2021 monthly demand was 472,100 unit nights. June 2021 average monthly unit occupancy was 79.9%. Hawaii vacation rentals statewide reported substantial increases in supply, demand, occupancy, and average daily RAT, ADR, in June 2021 compared to June 2020. However, in comparison to June 2019, vacation rental supply, demand and ADR were down while occupancy rose slightly due to a reduction in supply levels. Similarly, through the first half of 2021, Hawaii vacation rentals reported overall increases in the same performance categories compared to 2020, but lagged behind the pre-pandemic totals reported for the first half of 2019. The Hawaii Tourism A-U-T-H-O-R-I-T-Y-H-T-A issued today the Hawaii Vacation Rental Performance Report for the month of June and first half of 2021 utilizing data compiled by Transparent Intelligence Incorporated. In June 2021, the total monthly supply of statewide vacation rentals was 591,100 unit NIGHTS, plus 74.1% versus 2020, minus 32.9% versus 2019, and monthly demand was 472,100 unit NIGHTS, plus 910.6% versus 2020, minus 27.1% versus 2019 that resulted in an average monthly unit occupancy of 79.9 PERCENT, plus 66.1 percentage points versus 2020, plus 6.3 percentage points versus 2019, for June, which was slightly higher than the occupancy of Hawaii's HOTELS, 77.0%. The ADR for vacation rental units statewide increased in June TO $242 year over YEAR, plus 17.0% versus 2020, minus 29.9% versus 2019, but was still significantly less than the ADR of $346 in June 2019. By comparison the ADR for hotels WAS $320 in June 2021. It is important to note that unlike hotels, units in vacation rentals, timeshare resorts and condominium hotels are not necessarily available year-round or each day of the month and often accommodate a larger number of guests than traditional hotel rooms. In June, legal short-term rentals were allowed to operate in Maui County and on Oahu Hawaii Island in Kauai, as long as they were not being used as a quarantine location. Hawaii's quarantine order for travelers due to the pandemic began on March 26, 2020, which immediately resulted in dramatic impacts to the state's tourism industry. During June 2021, most passengers arriving from out of state and traveling inter-county could bypass the state's mandatory 10-day self-quarantine with a valid negative COVID-19 not test result from a trusted testing partner prior to their departure to Hawaii through the Safe Travels program. In addition, Individuals who were fully vaccinated in Hawaii could bypass the quarantine order beginning June 15, 2021. Intercounty travel restrictions were lifted also as of June 15, 2021. The data in HTA's Hawaii Vacation Rental Performance Report specifically excludes units reported in its Hawaii Hotel Performance Report and its Hawaii Timeshare Quarterly Survey Report. A vacation rental is defined as the use of a rental house, condominium unit, private room in private home, or shared room space in private home. This report does not determine or differentiate between units that are permitted or unpermitted. The legality of any given vacation rental unit is determined on a county basis. First half 2021. Throughout the first half of 2021, the performance of Hawaii vacation rental properties was impacted by restrictions related to the COVID-19 pandemic. The supply of statewide vacation rentals for the first six months was 3.5 million unit NIGHTS, plus 4.2% versus 2020, minus 26.1% versus 2019, and demand was 2.2 million unit NIGHTS, plus 12.1% versus 2020, minus 40.1% versus 2019 
resulting in an average unit occupancy of 61.2 PERCENT plus 7.6 percentage points versus 2020, minus 19.0 percentage points versus 2019. During this same period, Hawaii hotels reported ADRAT $293 and occupancy of 48.1%. Island Highlights In June, Maui County had the largest vacation rental supply of all four counties with 227,300 available unit NIGHTS plus 112.6% versus 2020, minus 16.0% versus 2019. Unit demand was 184,900 unit NIGHTS plus 1,417.0% versus 2020, minus 12.1% versus 2019 resulting in 81.3% O-C-C-U-P-A-N-C-Y, plus 69.9 percentage points versus 2020, plus 3.6 percentage points versus 2019, with ADROF$267, plus 9.1% versus 2020, minus 31.4% versus 2019. In comparison, Maui County Hotels reported ADRAT $498 and occupancy of 79.2%. For the first half of 2021, the vacation rental supply for Maui County was 1.4 million unit NIGHTS plus 30.2% versus 2020 plus 1.6% versus 2019, and demand was 910,200 unit NIGHTS plus 38.6% versus 2020, minus 19.3% versus 2019. The average occupancy year to date through June was 63.9 PERCENT, plus 6.5 percentage points versus 2020, minus 20.6 20 percentage points versus 2019, and ADRWAS dollar 270, minus 11.8 percent versus 2020, minus 14.6 percent versus 2019. In comparison, Maui County Hotels reported ADRAT $475 and occupancy of 52.0 percent. Oahu Vacation Rental Supply was 148,700 available unit NIGHTS plus 34.4% versus 2020, minus 50.2% versus 2019, in June. Unit demand was 115,600 unit NIGHTS plus 847.8% .8 versus 2020, minus 48.3% versus 2019 resulting in 77.7% O-C-C-U-P-A-N-C-Y, plus 66.7 percentage points versus 2020, plus 2.8 percentage points versus 2019, and ADROF$200, plus 28.8% versus 2020, minus 31.4% versus 2019. Oahu Hotels reported ADRAT $227 and occupancy of 75.4%. For the first half of 2021, the vacation rental supply for Oahu was 822,400 unit NIGHTS, minus 20.9% versus 2020, minus 50.3% versus 2019, and demand was 530,000 unit NIGHTS, plus 0.3% versus 2020, minus 57.2% versus 2019. The average occupancy for year to date through June was 64.4 PERCENT, plus 26.8 percentage points versus 2020, minus 13.8 percentage points versus 2019, and $195, 6.6% versus 2020, minus 5.1% versus 2019. In comparison, Oahu Hotels reported ADRAT $197 and occupancy of 46.3%. The island of Hawaii vacation rental supply was 129,700 available unit NIGHTS plus 56.0% versus 2020, minus 35.4% versus 2019, in June. Unit demand was 104,500 unit NIGHTS plus 681.6% .6 versus 2020, minus 19.5% versus 2019 resulting in 80.6% O-C-C-U-P-A-N-C-Y, plus 64.5 percentage points versus 2020, plus 16.0 percentage points versus 2019, with ADROF$200, plus 20.7% versus 2020, minus 30.8% versus 2019. 
Hawaii Island Hotels reported ADR $8356 and occupancy of 79.0%. Year-to-date through June, vacation rental supply for the island of Hawaii was 749,600 unit NIGHTS, minus 5.9% versus 2020, minus 33.0% versus 2019, and demand was 493,700 unit NIGHTS, plus 6.5% versus 2020, minus 35.5% versus 2019. The average occupancy for the first half of the year was 65.9 PERCENT, plus 13.2 percentage points versus 2020, minus 3.7 percentage points versus 2019, and ADRWAS$207, plus 14.6% versus 2020, plus 1.1% versus 2019. In comparison, Island of Hawaii Hotels reported ADR AT $319 and occupancy of 51.3%. Kauai had the fewest number of available unit nights in June at 85,400, plus 120.5% versus 2020, minus 23.0% versus 2019. Unit demand was 67,200 unit NIGHTS, plus 648.9% versus 2020, minus 20.3% 20 versus 2019, resulting in 78.6% OCCUPA and CY, plus 55.5 percentage points versus 2020, plus 2.7 percentage points versus 2019, with ADROF$313 plus 8.6% versus 2020, minus 33.4% versus 2019. Kauai Hotels reported ADR AT $339 and occupancy of 78.4%. Year-to-date through June, vacation rental supply for Kauai was 536,500 unit NIGHTS, plus 16.8% versus 2020, minus 11.4% versus 2019 and demand was 228,100 unit NIGHTS, minus 18.7% versus 2020, minus 52.7% versus 2019. The average occupancy for the first half of the year was 42.5 PERCENT, minus 30.3 percentage points versus 2020, minus 46.6 percentage points versus 2019, and $303 plus 0.5% versus 2020, minus 10.6% versus 2019. In comparison, Kauai Hotels reported ADR AT $269 and occupancy of 43.3%.